Hello good people. We are here today, Sleepy Hollow. We're about to show you an amazing modern new brownstone. This one is an end unit, which means you have more window space, more bright lighting, more illumination. I'm very excited. Let's check it out. So over here we have our first floor bedroom. It can be used as a flex space. Right now it's set up as a bedroom and it's, it's a beautiful bedroom. It could be used as an office, it can be used as a living room, however you want to do it is how you do it. But it does have a bathroom for convenience and if you look over here we have a full bathroom. Stand up shower with a nice shower bench. We have a throne and, and, and sink area and you can obviously look at yourself in the mirror as you do. Then behind you over here we have a closet. This is the first floor closet, not bad for a guest room, right? And then as you look around, you'll see nothing but big, bright windows. So you can wake up with the sun if you like, without an alarm clock. And it's a lot more peaceful when you wake up with the sun. And here in the foyer, you have your nine foot ceilings. Can't even jump to the top. You have your hallway here, foot. leads to the garage, two car garage, true size, huge. This is your drop off zone, right? You can hang your coats, hang your umbrellas, your hats. This is great, so much space. And this is basically the first floor. And this way, we go to the second floor. Yeah, let's bring it upstairs. Let's. I love the wall treatment. You have a sheetrock and wood kind of finish with these modern lights, super modern lights. Very, very, very artistic. Very artistic bathroom. We have a half bath on the, on the living room, on the second landing. And then if you look this way, here is your second floor, right? Your dining area, kitchen and living area, all in one, it's amazing. If you take a look at this kitchen, you'll see how special it is because of the deep and warm colors that encompass it. We have quartz countertops all around. We have a, a, central, a central bar and uh, the sink that leads out to the window. You have your views out the window as opposed to on the island as it is in some models. And then all the cabinetry, they're non-slam. They close nice and easy. See? Won't slam. Won't slam. You have your pantry right here. Also, you have a balcony. Second floor balcony that is right out here. These balconies are awesome. Very roomy. You can put a grill here if you want. And you're far enough from your neighbors, right? You can enjoy some fresh air. The views are pretty cool. This is really nice. A lot of air and it's right next to the kitchen, right? So you can really air your kitchen out if you need. You don't have to worry about those smoke alarms, not in here, because after you close that door, and you have all that fresh air, you can come and sit down this way in the, to the living area and just relax with your guests or by yourself or with your husband or wife or your kids. And uh, you know, it's, there's lots of room to just lounge. My favorite part about this house is the staggered flooring. Now we have engineered five to four inch staggered flooring and it brings you out to a Juliet balcony. I really like this facade right here, right? You have the mantle, the fireplace, the TV. This is so cool. It really pops, right? There's, it's a different color than the rest of the floor and it really brings this whole thing together. It's like an anchor for the living room. Now, if you look up it, with the recessed lighting, you'll also see built-in speakers. You have surround sound throughout the whole entire house. Now, if you come upstairs, we'll show you some more rooms. What do we have here, Dom? So, Dan, wait till I show them this. What do we got? We got two bedrooms on the side of the house, right? So we have a, a little kid's bedroom or a guest bedroom or however you want to situate it. Again, big bright windows throughout. We have more than enough space in the closet and then there's more than enough space in the room for built up armoires or whatever you need for storage. Now if you follow me to the next room. We have something very similar, right? We have one window as opposed to two sets of windows, but just equal amount of space. Uh, same kind of closet, you know, good enough storage. 
And again, this is built, this is perfect for kids or guests or however you want to situate it. But there's an option, you don't have to have this wall here. This could be one big room and have two closets and three sets of, as three sets of windows as opposed to two sets of windows. And you can really make your guests feel at home or it could be like a second master bedroom. Now, if you look this way, we have a shared bathroom area. Show me this bath. I'm gonna show you this bathroom. Now, if you see this, <laughs> if you look at this bathroom, you'll see again, the dark color concept with the white, uh, white and light contrast. Over here to my right, we have a linen closet. If it's more than enough for all of your towels and linens. Then over here, we have the throne and bath area, stand up shower, look at that shower head, super modern, super comfortable. You're gonna wanna take a shower here. Now back it up. We have a his and hers sink, so nobody has to fight over which side is which. If you're a lefty, you can take this side. If you're a righty, you take this side. Or if you want to make things difficult, you switch it. And you got to make sure your house is convenient, right? It's all about convenience, which means a washer and dryer on the bedroom floors, right? So you have two bedrooms that you just saw right next to your Whirlpool appliances and the master bedroom, which we're going to see now. So, very roomy, very bright, right? Plenty of room for your bed, accent walls. Look at, look at all the details in this room, right? You have accent on the ceiling, huge oversized walk-in, huge walk-in closets. Look how big this is, right? And you can upgrade this. You can make this even nicer, put more lighting. You can really have this your way. This is one of those things you can customize love that hat. Also, most importantly, this is where you find your master bathroom. Right through here, secluded, small door, you come into this, right? Very cozy, very small. However, this has everything you need. Very functional bathroom, right? Glass enclosed shower, tile everywhere, upgraded sinks, Kohler sinks, Again, natural stone, cabinets, this is amazing. You also have this big window here, brings in a lot of light, as you can see, it's in my face. This is a great bed. I also love there, the builder's attention to detail. As you look up above, you'll see the shelving on the top. It's not functional, but it looks really nice, especially with the light accent. I don't know if you can see it in this room right now with all the lights on, but there is a light perimeter around the whole room where the shelving is. Now this floor is great because there's no other bedrooms or really rooms. It's kind of just an intermediary space. It's kind of just a place where you go in between places. They do have another bathroom. Like I said, there's a bathroom on every floor and there is storage. So this is the bathroom on the last floor, the top floor. And you, as you can see, it's accented with mosaic very nicely done as far as being modern and clean and straight and to the point, right? And again, this is like a kind of an in-between floor anyway, right? You're going from your bedroom upstairs to your balcony, of course. So this is the oversized, over-upgraded balcony. This has everything you can possibly imagine, right? You have your bar here. Behind you, there's a barbecue area, a dining space, a lounge space. My favorite, linear fireplace, gas, beautiful, right? You have the accent and you can really sit here and enjoy a little warmth on a cold September, October 31st afternoon evening, right? That's absolutely right. Not only that, we have hardwood flooring outside as well as inside. We have all of the amenities that you would want in a nice modern brownstone and then some. If you look over here, we have a nice sink with a, with a wet bar. You have an outdoor mini fridge to set up your scotches and wines and beers or whatever else it is that you like to drink. And then if you bring it this way, we have a fully functional grill and stove top, right? So you can bring out your guests, you can bring out your family, whatever it is you guys like to do. You can grill, you can grill your vegan meals out here. You can grill your non-vegan meals out here. Uh, so here we have two burners and quite an amount of space in there as well. So this is absolutely fantastic for entertaining. 
Do you want to have a party I afternoon? Do. I do want to have you a party. You always do. I always do. And you really have plenty of room to do it, whether it's in the kitchen, in the living room, or out here, outside. Today is a beautiful day to do so. It's basically a party house. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Obviously, you can customize it, have it your way. Build time is about 15, 16 months. There are about 20 lots left. Get yours today. So a lot of the things that we're looking at in this house are optional. They're upgrades and you can do with or without them once you, once you buy the house. So things like the fireplace and the wood flooring and etc. You don't have to have these things. But as is, the price is about 1.3 as you're seeing it now. You can go a little lower, you can go a little higher depending on what your taste is. They also have an elevator option. If you don't want to walk up all these stairs, you can take the elevator up and just for ease of use. And you don't have to stress yourself even though it is good exercise. Correct. So if you guys have any questions, if you guys want to see this model, any other models in the neighborhood, let us know, contact us. We'll be happy to schedule a showing for you guys and help you find your dream home. Comment below if you have anything to say or ask. And like this video, subscribe to the channel, share it with your friends. We'll see you in the next one.